Hello and welcome back to Seeker 2 with our Norska Derby campaign. Where our next try target will be this guy. Um, so I've been t taking a look at this. I was uh, thinking about attacking them, but their supply is so damn low. I don't think it's even possible. Like, there are 800 supply here, there's at least a garrison of more than 1k. So I cannot siege this down, which is just stupid. Um, so yeah, I think I'm just gonna stick with my own lands for now, and once I have, I don't know, enough military organization to march through there, I will. Is it military? Yeah, it's military organization. But that's gonna take a while. Legalism, though, that's one I want. Let's see, important decision, open the book of grudges. Well, there's no, we don't have any grudges, so... I think that's an awesome new mechanic, though. You know, heir to our dynasty, titles and succession, special mana targets, incredible. Oh, we need a couple of commanders. Let's see, you're my renowned. Uh, okay, so you all have stats, of course, because you're dwarves, but they are mostly negative. Dismiss for now, and we can shut the gates. I don't care really give a shit about that mentioning. You can stop mentioning that. What are you doing there? You're. I. Okay, is this the. Problem when you go through some of this like years later and days later or weeks later, and you're like, uh, something's going on here. I can't remember what. A peculiar tradition. According to Councillor Librium, the peasant of, Cro of Crocker Drucker started a delightful tradition where the peasantry from several villages meet up and dance, feast, and pair up for future marriage. By promoting this tradition, uh, Le uh, Lea Bremier believes that the county will develop a strong local culture, will attract more peasants. I will support that, yeah, definitely. Which gives us some prosperity. I knew this was a good investment. Hicknund has become a renowned physician. Which makes him even better as my doctor. So, I thought we got some prosperity here, but it wasn't really there yet. A hospital in this county, oh no. Well, first up, I, th I did get the modifier though, Harvest Festivals. Ancestral monument. Anyway, first up is the. Let's get that started! Drink ourselves, silly! Uh, put him up. Uh, ooh, that hurts. Um, so. We're. Okay, so we just got ourselves uh, got wounded. Oh, there they We still got a crutch, however. Is there something I can do? Like, seek treatment for the illness? Doesn't already have a successful treatment? Well, that was fun. So our treatment is still, you know, we're working on it, I guess. That's not appropriate. Though I might need a bastard son to... Oh wait, we're not married anymore, are we? Yeah, but we're getting married in like a couple of years. A daughter will have a maternal marriage, so all our children will be very well. Uh, never. Come on, piss off. Why would I do that? See more around prosper happened. Winning a war, I think, is good. War chest. We are a kingdom. How much money does that? Uh, about a th uh, like seven hundred. Yeah, that's not gonna happen anytime soon. So let's not take that one. Let's definitely not take that one. Ah, we no longer wounded, but we're scarred. We look like a proper dwarf. Got a scar on my face. At least for a moment he ran out after throwing out a chair, making you stumble, except that you couldn't find him. Maybe he's just not even angry anymore. Alright. Alright. When does our... Like, 29. So there's four more years before we could go to the next war. I could go to war with this guy if I really wanted to. See, that's the real question here. Do I really want to go to war with that guy? I'm approving somebody's opinion though. It was, must have been something I was attempting to do. Right, I think it was assassination. Um, I don't need claims, I can do holy wars, I can do a lot of shit, but I, I don't need this guy. I can just kind of, okay, start pissing off the his nobles. Okay, we got some prosperity. Hell yeah. That guess is even more money. 
which makes me a happy little dwarf. So we need about 280, ugh, whatever. Come on, um, get rid of this. Craftsman, choose a mutual friend. Yeah, but I could have, I could have a friend. More friends. What a close-knit bunch of dwarves is what we are. And on the council, it looks like a you know, friendly bunch here. Of course I'll come. Why would I turn off a party? I think it's part of us, you know, drinking like we fall down. Uh, primogenitor requires me to... I require me to do something, I can't remember what though. Um, right, I had to do that, then I could do latent administration by upping my legalism. And change the way our laws worked, that reminds me. Let's get our status of women up. Excellent news, some gold. Most of these guys just vote for it. Lord Skjold. This guy. And some of them are still on the fence. Like this woman, why is she on the fence? I could give you more rights. Okay, so request council support. Okay, they approved. Very well. Let's play. Uh, I could do that, yeah. Let's get them full um, significance. Because I, I don't know why they wouldn't be. Um, okay. I think we're, we're doing good here. So when can I do another one? Um, 2030, so in five years, but I think by that time we'll probably do the other one. I don't know. Um, yeah, looking at this, we're getting like 0.9. How often do we gain these points? Like every month? I don't know, but I'm not gonna stay looking at this window because the hammering on the background is just completely giving me a migraine. I get why it's hammering, it's like technology, building things, new inventions, but it's really annoying. Speaking of really annoying shit, um, she loves greatness, so we, uh, I'll become stressed for her sake. So you're the leader of this bunch, 2.9 thousand troops, it's too much actually. Because I'm running at a solid 3.8, hey, we're no longer stressed. Let's start partying more. Um, there is, let's see, Orzmatic Caliphate. Um, so, you're my best friend. Aww. Anyway, we got uh, Crossing of the Brutal Life. No money, no money, no money. Now, this is money, but it's only two. This is three. So, yeah, Copper Mine is next up. Uh, but I don't know, more gold than we got there. Um, Prosperity increases. Nice, getting messenger stations, which will run for like two years, but gives us a little bit of supply. Not the supply limit, but what's the prosperity here that can make a difference? I hate how my accent is trying to switch to something more like a dwarf on one. I've been playing The Dwarfs, a game recently released by a studio called Please Forgive Me for I Don't Know the Name. Oh god, I feel embarrassed. The dwarves. Dwarves? Oh, come on, don't write dwarves with a B. Uh, let's see, it's produced by... Ba -ba 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 -ba. King Art, and it's been published by THQ Nordic and Euro Video Mendin. Same guys that build uh, a lot of uh, point-and-click adventures, pretty good point-and-click adventures. It's a good game, I like it. Um, it's a good story. It's really story driven, by the way. It's like you're being presented a book. Um, instead of reading it yourself, it's kind of reading is done for you, partially. It's like an audiobook, sort of, with interaction? Yeah, it's like an audiobook with interaction. That's, I think, a very good description of what the game is. Good story. Good universe. Worth your time. And a great combat system. 
Might need a bit, might a bit of polishing here and there, but uh, I think as, as what they have so far is really impressive. I like it. Uh, Dwarven Forges, no. It's the Copper Mines, 60 more. But yeah, it's, it's a game that revolves around dwarves. You know, what better game is there to be made? Dwarves are amazing, and there's just nothing more to be said about that. For instance, like in, in World of Warcraft, it's like a shame they're part of the Alliance, because the Alliance are a bunch of dweebs, in my honest opinion. But yeah, you know, the only awesome race they've got is the dwarves, so you kind of like them, yeah. Uh, how do I do that? Oh, what a great eminence! Oh, noise! What a... Relations, she's friends with... Oh, for some reason I'm going through a lot of people here, but except the ones I want to see. You! You're betrothed to this 14-year-old kid. You're a genius, he's brilliant and hardy. You're brilliant, so that would get good children. Very well, let's play. I'll get you next time. Okay. Declared Grunkle during Orc Greenskin Uprising on Gold and Tear. What the? Holy shit! That's just a massive Greenskin Uprising. This came out of fucking nowhere. Problem is, this is mountainous territory, so we got light infantry and a couple of archers. We've got a lot of heavy infantry. I guess some special units and a couple of archers. Probably quarrelers, more likely. I guess crossbowmen make more sense. Well, that was fun. What I could actually do here, of course, is call, not my allies, but raise my vassal levies. Alright, strike in. When that fight is happening, we can call up the remainder of the vassal levies. Oh, that's no problem. This guy's getting wrecked. Aren't you a little dead guy? There we go. Everybody stand down. That was a nice little fight after a night of drinking. Make us proud. Wow, that is a great honor. Wow, did she become... <laughs> she became a dwarven engineer! Uh, she did just... <laughs> join... This guy is my rival. But you have, like, a guild of engineering or something along those lines, like... Thunder Range, or there's something here that's... I also remember it's like a special building or something. Ne. Kringi Grimnir. Valera. Ah, right, whatever. Um. Ah, uh, that is. However, she just became. Why is she at his court? Did she? Did he invite her, or is she's not at court? Yeah, she'll go back here. Mmm, going to hiding. This is my paranoia playing up. Yeah, it is. And so that's the reason why I can close the gates, I think, at all time. Thank you for coming back home. I was kind of annoyed that you were... You just bailed up. don't like it when you do that. War, war honorary title. Here we go, Regent. I'm forced to say. Damn it. She's good at what she do. Studying mechanical engineering. So she'll have a lot of learning, a lot of. She'll be my damn diplomat if I get anything to say with it. Apparently, women have no longer. not the right state is yet to do that. Close enough, though. Um, just a couple more points. Just a couple more points. Did I just lose, by the way, all that money because of that orcish ho horde? What? Okay, that's definitely not fun. Not what I have planned. Uh, trying to encourage me to turn against my liege, King and Shims. Echo got punished for the appearance that decided to imprison your Chancellor for an indefinite period of time. That is outrageous. Why would you do that? There's no reason for you to do that. I was definitely not trying to incentivize rebellion in your lands. Eh, who gives a shit? So which house is this? You. You have children? No. Uh, 
your death is not really beneficial for me, to be honest, because I'm, well, you know, it gives me land. You're strong, a strong gardener. That's weird for a dwarf, isn't it? Gardening? Must be in a stone pot or something along those lines. I suggest Lord Haldorf that I bring you the, out the board and pieces to play. But a strategist, he has accepted. We play for money. Very well. Play for hours. Oh, wait, eventually for a quarter opening, I made a few inspired aggressive moves again and won the game. We won a game of Warhammer. He's a good guy, though, this guy. I don't want to go. He's a good commander. He's got a shit as a diplomat, but, you know, can't have it all. Betroth can marry. Um, this is my marriage. So, hells to the yes. Get this marriage underway. I have a wife. I accept your suggestion of this union. Did I just accept my own suggestion for this union? That is not weird at all. This is worrying. People are trying to get, get you know, attack my daughter. So he'll be... What's your birth date? Okay, so in like five months, he will... Be ready to rumble, and at some around the same time that we will be there. So where does this kid come from? Because if it comes out of the, you know, one of our warring empires, nations, your... Oh no, I'm your leash. Okay, so that's fine. Um, you're a dwarven engineer, and you're studying mechanical engineering. Delving into deep engineering knowledge. I wish I could do that. Wait, can I go you know, higher, learn masonry when I have... No, I need to be either diligent or ambitious or zealous. I can become zealous by... No, I want to keep the family focused because I need more kids. Out of that, I'll go for theology, which makes me zealous. I have the pox, I have the crutz, which gives me minus 20% fertility, which is now offset by this. As long as I'm not infertile, it's all good and dandy with fine meat. She's smart and she's hardy. Got some good stats going around in my family. Uh, since no, we're not gonna send myself into hiding. Unit commander. Let's see, is there anything here? Personal combat skill minus one, minus one, minus one. Well, you have personal combat skill, so yeah, I guess. This is 1930. 1930, 2030. Jesus ass. Uh, this is close there. Like a couple more points. Okay. Soon I can declare war on you again. It's gonna be just great. So that's the end of this year. My daughter will marry soon-ish. In, let's see, that is the 27th of the fifth month. So in a month, this guy will turn 16. And he will marry my daughter. Uh, with the only purpose to provide her with children. Which makes sense. So we've got technological technological investment. Military organization is kind of nice to have. And the betrothed can marry. You're a ugly son of a dwarf, but your stats just... Your stats aren't even that good, but you've got brilliant and hardy. So I imagine how bad this guy... This guy has uh, got a brilliant mind and he's, you know, for a dwarf he's even, you know, fairly, you know, he's even stronger than your average dwarf. And he kind of failed, which is attractive. That means we've got all stats, basically, in our bloodline. Don't know the exact system they used to remember, but... Hmm. Anyway, declare war. I've got a sure claim on you. Ah, oh, shit, still truce breaker. It's the 11th month. Just need to wait a little bit longer. Of course I'll come. Have a good, nice party for a couple of months. We got ourselves a daughter. I don't know was born. I didn't know my queen was pregnant, to be honest. I'm not a daughter, great. Childhood focus, uh, well, thrift it is. There we go. I know I decided to do my six years old, which we kind of can already start just pushing. Just, just a slight little bit. A little, 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 little bit. I could put another castle here if I had the money. I would like that. Uh, yeah, go more carousing. 
drinking like a champion. I like it. What do we have? Is that tolerance? Is that the tolerance? Yes, that is our legalism. We cannot change the law until... Okay, next to another year, but we can declare war on you. It seems something fun to do in the meantime. The council's like, all of them are like, yeah, sure. There are other wars that are more important right now. No, we just clear out our neighbor. That seems like a good way of going. Is this still mountainous territory or is this not mountains? It's Arctic, even worse. Mountains. Well, that's different. Arctic has very low supply. But mountains has defensive bonus. This is flat land. Bam. Might be a little bit issue on supply though. Severe winter. Yeah, that's fine. Our technology is helping here. Um, so that gives me like two and a half k in it. <laughs> These lands are so bad. Pig in homeland. All that kind of stuff. Oh, well, let's start feasting again, because this guy, uh, this war is done for. We just need to sit in his capital, which is a mad Let's have a party, yeah. Uh, you know what? Recruit a... Nope. Ah, uh, ten gold, so that's fine. Let's see, we need a new commander, that's why. Well, you're shit. But you're somebody. I like these uh, weird eyebrows you're having, mate. Be you're diligent, you know. You could become somebody at some point. You're merely 16 years old. Pick a patron deity. Not really need to. I need a son for crying out loud. Are you pregnant? You are back home. That's a good thing. Um, it's a bit weird to ask your daughter. Hey, are you pregnant yet? Are you pregnant yet? Are you pregnant yet? Are you purgage yet? Let's see, I should start reading- no, let's take her out for a hunt. Let's see how that goes. Um, poetry save it. Well, let's go for poetry then, I guess. I'm not really in the mood to get things depressed. Let's see, close, next month. I think administration is not something that they would object to at all. I would like to up the women, but uh, women can, can relate to ruler, can allot office as Chancellor Stewart, Chancellor Stewart and Marshall, Chancellor Stewart and Marshall, absolute negative succession laws, female rulers, and no occur negative opinion modifiers, and allow change of gender preference laws. I don't know what that means. Fame and fortune await. We become a poet. A little bit of. Uh, sure. Uh, request support. What does she do in accounts for the, and you'll owe her a favor? Well, that's fine. I need one other. Um, wait, no, wait, but she's opposed to late feudal administration law, so she is still opposed to it. But I did, I oh, know. These are the guys. Alright. Um, this is a friend of mine? This is not a friend of mine. This is my spy master. I'll request counter soul support from him. There we go. They got the law through. So you owe, I owe you a favor. Well. Oh, that's late. Well, whatever. Um, but we're going to seek treatment for my illness. That still means that I need to change my succession law, which I cannot do because... Is it peace? Oh, right, we're at war. He... I forgot. My life is in your hands. He's a renowned physician. I feel amazing. So, he's managing to treat me somehow where it's not getting rid of the disease. So we still have that, but we gain better stats in return. It's a bit of mixed bag, really, because we just lose. We still have our minus fertility and my minus thirty percent attraction opinion, minus thirty, which is, you know, opposite of my attractive. 
Fever's broken, perhaps only temporary, but I can still see the shadow face looking around the corners. Are they real? What do they want? We become twitchy. Minor paranoia just set in. We're stubborn. Isn't that a common trait for old wars? For stubborn little guys, fairly angry. You know. I need to break the two fortresses. Jesus. This is a. what? 11 and a half. This is an 11 and a half. We're gaining 2%. You don't want to see the Dwarven Fortress, that's clear. Anyway, are you pregnant? Brugonade. Nope. Um, for some time now, my wife Queen Helena has been avoiding me. She's not visited a bad chamber for several weeks. But I've managed to know why she's given me such... She's even not good about feeble excuses. Today I've heard a couple of her servants gossiping. Said it was as contracted syphilis. Oh my... Surely there's another reason. I had syphilis before that. After being skilled for treatment conversation, my wife is feeling much better. Perhaps she's deserving my praise. Uh, sure. Which, so she is. Yeah, we both have it. Uh, well, we're twitchy. It's not a big surprise that we're both having it. It's, you know, this is a venereal disease plague, even here. Uh, oh, we have a. Child, which is brilliant, great, but it's not gonna help me with anything. Um, not a brilliant guy, and it's the only possibility. Well, we'll put this guy up for uh, for it. Seems like the female gene is uh, stronger in our uh, my family. Female gene, I know how it works, there's X and Y, and women are X, X and male are X and Y. Oh, we got our war score. Good. It seems those that carry that gene benefit us more. Um, <laughs> cost gold. Okay, let's just first finally build a copper mine. Or silver mine, we had a copper mine. A new ambition. Ooh. You know what? Groom and air. That seems like something I really want to do now. Okay, let's put you down. Oh, I'm holding this. That's not really what I want. Can I give this to my daughter? No, not yet. Okay, so we can have seniority, the oldest member. We have primogenitor, the which is what my oldest child of the ruler. That's what I want. I want. There we go. Of course, I woke up. But that still kind of leaves us with uh, an act is only women can inherit. Women can inherit the same grounds as men do. This requires um, either one of these culture groups. Or don't know. Uh, yeah, I don't think we can do that. Our law simply doesn't do not allow it. This might be even more. So that's impossible. Well, we're a maniac. Oh, we need to already have the law agnatic cognatic. Uh, culture Amazon. Right, before this, we need to have excellent news. We get some money. Imperial Italian is over oh, halfling, Lustrian halfling. Guess like, let me know. religious religion is There is something here, though, in the laws that changes that. I should change it. Said it's been in full. Women can inherit. Female rulers do not incur negative fellows. Allows absolute cognatic succession laws. There might be even more just exchange for this. This is. So here's where the law is allowed to change. 
So my oldest child should inherit. If that's not the case, it's the next one in line. You're not at home a lot. That might be bothersome for the fact that you know you won't have any children. Anyway, I'm actually gonna end the video here. I wanna thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time. Have a good day. Bye bye.